Ready. Hey, you got a horse next to it. Yeah, not a very well cared for a horse at that. Goes over there and goes, forget it. Yeah. When he was in agility class, when when he'd gone through the course three or four times and he started to get tired and it was a little bit warm, uh -huh. and then to be his turn, he'd go through and he would uh, he'd go through the weave bars and he'd get done with that, and then that was it. He'd lay down. <laughs> um, and he, you know, did the same sort of thing. When he first got to those classes, he was really nervous and there were a lot of dogs and it took him a while, but after an hour or so on the first week, then he was pretty comfortable. And then the rest of the class, he was just happy with all the dogs, you know. Now, my opinion, because you can adopt whatever dog you want, I'm not going to say one way or the other, because I just like them all to find good homes, but you're going to have a less competitive and a calmer duo with a boy-girl. Sure. I've always known it for everybody, and I've never understood why anyone wants to go boy-boy or girl-girl. But, I mean, some people just like the cuteness of the dog, and who'd want two black dogs anyway? But the, 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 you'll, have a, you'll have a calmer, sweeter, nicer, uh, just... Nor more normal two-dog duo when you